this is God of Lightning 5 here and I have a special tutorial requested on how to use Time Machine and I was requested by YouTuber The Help Tech. Um, the only basic thing you need is a flash drive but Time Machine is only accessed on Windows I mean um, Mac, sorry, can't be accessed on Windows and once you have it plugged in you will see it'll appear right, it'll, it'll appear right here. Mine is called Jack's Flash Drive. So now, uh, what you gotta do is, um, you gotta choose a file that you don't need, and that's kind of the point, that's what the point of Time Machine is, so you can get more space on your computer. So, let's just say we wanna delete, um, anything you want. I'm gonna delete, uh, for example, something called, well, actually, I already have something deleted in there that I'm gonna bring back down, and it's called, it's an episode of South Park. But, before you do that, make sure you put the, f the item in your flash drive first. So I'm gonna uh, pretend, well not really do this, but you can just drag this item into the flash drive. Oh, darn it, sorry I have the expose thing activated out there so it'll be hard. What you do is you drag this into your flash drive and you see a plus and it's like says it's, it'll go in there. But I'm not gonna do that, but that's all you gotta do. And once you do that, you can delete this and put it in the trash can, like right here and well actually I can't be deleted now but you'll get it so after that you will click on time machine right here and it'll bring you up into this weird thing of outer space now you will click on your flash drive and you I put it in a folder called movies but normally it'll appear right here but since I put it in movies I will click on it and now we will press cancel to go back down and now I can just drag it into iTunes. Oops. Go back to Jack's Flash Drive. Go to Movies. And I can just drag it right here, but I'm not going to now since I don't need it. So that's just a basic Time Machine tutorial. I know it wasn't that long, and it's very easy to use. So, yeah, I hope this helped you, the help tech, and I hope this helps other people who are learning how to use Time Machine. Uh, see you later. Bye.